heat alarm. It is a special safety device that responds to a rise in temperature and gets activated in case of a fire. Unlike smoke detectors, they do not respond to smoke and thus are designed to save property rather than life. An electronic heat detector alarm contains a thermistor which changes resistance as the temperature increases. These are the components, which are needed in this project. 1. NPN, transistor, BC547, 1 kilo ohm resistor, 1, 47 kilo ohm variable resistor, 1 buzzer, 1 red LED, 1 thermistor, NTC type, 9 volt battery, PP3 battery connector, on off, rocker switch, 1 zero PCB, 4 screw with nuts and 4 plastic spacers Before making the project, we will understand its circuit diagram This is a 9 volt battery to power up the circuit This is an on off switch which is used to start or stop the project This is a power supply indication LED This is a current limiting resistor to protect the LED from high current and voltage this is the symbol of a thermistor. Thermistor is a type of resistor whose resistance changes with its temperature. Thermistors are of two type, NTC or negative temperature coefficient and PTC or positive temperature coefficient. We are using NTC type thermistor. In NTC type thermistor, resistance decreases with rise in temperature. So in this circuit, when the thermistor will sense the heat, its resistance will decrease. As the resistance decreases, the voltage at the base terminal of transistor will increase. When this voltage reaches at 0.7 volt, then transistor will turn on. This is the symbol of a buzzer. Its positive end is connected with a positive supply and negative end is connected with the transistor. When transistor will turn on, it will connect the negative terminal of buzzer with the ground and buzzer will start beeping as the temperature goes down the resistance of thermistor will increase and voltage at the base terminal of transistor will decrease when this voltage goes below 0.7 volt transistor will turn off and buzzer will come in silent mode this 47 kilo ohm adjustable resistor which is also called potentiometer can be used to adjust the level of heat at which we want to turn on the buzzer. These are the components which we will use to make our project. We will take a zero PCB and make a hole at each of its corner. We will insert a one inch screw inside the hole. Now we will take a plastic spacer and then we will use a nut to lock the spacer now our PCB base is ready. To switch on or off our project we will use an on off switch. We need to make a big hole to fit this switch on the PCB. To protect the LED from high voltage and current, we will use a 1 kilo ohm current limiting resistor. We will solder a power indication LED on the PCB. Now, we will solder the thermistor. Same like resistor, thermistor also don't have polarity. So we can mount it from either side. These green sleeves are used to avoid the shorting between its two terminals.
Now we will mount this variable resistor. It has three pins. We will use the two pins, middle pin, and any one of the side pins. This is a buzzer. Buzzer has two terminals, positive and negative. It has a sign of plus on its top. It shows that this side is positive, and the other side is negative. Now we will solder this NPN transistor BC547. Now we will make the hole for battery connector. This battery connector is of PP3 type. In this connector, the red wire is for positive, and black wire is for negative. Now we will connect the 9 volt battery and test the project. We have used this aluminum plate so that thermistor can easily sense the temperature. To test the project, we will generate the heat around it. As the surrounding temperature of thermistor increases, it will give the beep. As the temperature will decrease, the volume of beep will also decrease, and at some temperature buzzer will come in silent mode. Our circuit is working perfectly. I hope you enjoyed the video, and learned something from it. For any help or to clear your doubts regarding your project, you can contact us on our student care number 7007957715. To buy the items used in this project, you can visit our website www.eraltech.com. You can give us the orders on WhatsApp also. Thank you so much.